Hello, and welcome to our lesson on finding the volume of a prism. So we're going to begin by finding the volume of this cube. And to do this, we work out the area of one face. So I'm going to take the front face here. And the area of this face is a product of the length and the height, which is 4 centimetres multiplied by 4 centimetres. So the area of the face is 16 centimetres squared. Now to work out the volume, we need to think of it as we have four lots of this face repeated throughout the depth of the cube. So a volume will be the area of a cross section, which is 16 centimetres squared, multiplied by the depth of four centimetres, which is 64 centimetres cubed. So in this cube, for instance, we now know the 64 centimetres cubed to make up the entire volume. Do you want to try and work out the volume of the red cuboid? You can pause the video and resume it when you're ready. So again, I'm going to begin by working out the area of the cross section. I could have picked any face as it could each be a cross section. So the area of this face will be your product of the length and the height which is 3 centimetres multiplied by 5 centimetres, which is 15 centimetres squared. To work out the volume, I'm going to multiply this 15 centimetres squared by the depth of 6 centimetres, because you can imagine there are 6 lots of less repeated throughout the shape. So that would be 15 centimetres squared multiplied by 6 centimetres. 15 times 6 is 90, and centimetres squared times centimetres is centimetres cubed. OK, let's try one more question. So in this question, we're going to find the volume of the triangular prism. Do you want to try and calculate the volume of this triangular prism yourself by considering the triangular face as the cross-section? You can pause the video and resume it when you're ready. So the volume will be a product of a cross-sectional area multiplied by the depth. So the area of a cross-section is found by this triangle here. Where the perpendicular height is 3 cm and the base is 4 cm. So to work out this area, we're going to consider it as a rectangle. This will be 3 cm multiplied by 4 cm. And because it is half a triangle, we're going to divide this by 2. So we have 6 centimetres squared. And that is the area of the cross section. We can see the depth is 8 centimetres. And to work out the volume, we have the 6 times the 8, which is 48. The centimetres squared times centimetres. So the volume is 48 centimetres cubed. Okay, thank you for watching and I hope you found that useful. Thanks again and take care.